This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us be glad and rejoice in it. I am so excited that we can um, begin our day with the wonderful word of God. And my dear friend, today is day number 28 in our sister day journey into the word of God. And we are still on the book of Psalms. Today we are reading from Psalm chapter 6 to chapter 38. In fact, the book of Psalms is a wonderful book. Take your time and enjoy this book and you will be blessed. Psalm chapter 6 to chapter 38. Now, our devotional message today is taken from Psalm chapter 1. I know we have already read Psalm chapter 1, but I want to go back to learn something very, very important as we begin our day. Now, Psalm chapter 1, um, verse 1 says that, Blessed is the one who walks not in the step with the wicked, or stand in the way that sinners take, or sit in the company of mockers. So you realize that in this very first verse of the book of Psalms, God calls those who walks with him blessed. And I love this. But one thing I want us to really understand is verse 3 of um, Psalm chapter 1. Listen, the Bible says, That person is like a tree planted by streams of water, which yields its fruit in season, and whose leaf does not wither. Whatever they do prospers. Isn't it amazing? You see, in the book of Psalms, King David uses analogies throughout the book of Psalms, you know, to talk about what God would do for his people. And in Psalm chapter 1, verse 1 up to 3, King David makes us understand that when we walk with God faithfully, and when we do not do the things that the people of the world do, when we do not sit in the seat of the mockers, King David says that we are going to be like a tree that is planted by streams of water. You know, when you see, I mean, when you see a stream and there is a tree planted by it, that tree has a constant supply of water. Even in the dry season, that tree has a constant supply of water. And so that tree does not go through any problem. It does not, you know, experience, you know, leaves falling off as a result of lack of water. It has constant supply of nutrient because it is found by the streams of water. And God says, when you do that, say yes, the Lord, when you walk with me faithfully, when you shun the ways of the wicked, when you shun the ways of sinners, when you delight in my law, God says you are going to be like a tree planted by the rip, by the streams of waters. And what I love about this text is that it says, whatever they do prospers. Whatever you touch would prosper. Whatever you think about, God will cause it to come to pass. It is when you, when you walk with God faithfully like this, that is when whatever you ask in his name, he will provide for you. So my dear friend, today as you go about with your life, there is an opportunity for you to be planted by God by streams of living waters. There is an opportunity for you to be positioned in a place where you will never lack, in a place where everything that you do will prosper. And it begins by beginning to analyze your work, your relationship with God. If you decide to work with God faithfully and do that say yes the Lord, God would establish you. He will position you at a place where you will never lack. Your bread would always be assured and whatever you do would prosper. May this be your portion, even as you spend time today meditating on the word of God. And may God continue to bless you, even as you decide to shun the ways of the world and to live for him and meditate on his law all the days of your life. God bless you and do have a blessed day. Shalom.